This is the 28th annual Frederick County Science and Engineering Fair. This is a great opportunity for students to show their work, their interest in problem solving, uh, to share their information with scientists and their colleagues, um, and to just have a great time sharing their knowledge about science and the world around them that they enjoy. My project's on how uh, fuel cells' performances are affected by the temperature that they operate in. I got a hands-on experience on how to electrolyze water and that was actually pretty cool, splitting the water into hydrogen and oxygen. When I was doing my project, it was kind of confusing how the things all work, but by making a circuit a diagram, everything just kind of came together. Uh, we have uh, 13 different projects, categories that students can choose from, and our hope is that by providing these opportunities, students can find a topic that really interests them, that they feel um, that they are really good at, and that they choose to pursue science, technology, engineering, or math, um, often um, called STEM, uh, that they choose an area of that that they feel successful in, and they choose to continue to pursue that either more into high school or from high school on into college. For my project, I mainly just try to find out how antibacterial soap works and what kinds actually work, like what kind of active ingredient works the best in killing bacteria. My final conclusion was that soap with triclosan actually works a lot better than soap with chlorhexylenol. And they're both really common active ingredients. I really learned how to plan and carry out a scientific experiment, most of all, I think. Well, it's just a really great experience and it's a great way to organize yourself and you know, get everything organized. In the middle school and high school fair this year, it's safe to say that we do not have any volcanoes. <laughs>